Yeah, the surf and kayak program is about transferring um, skill and talent from surf into kayak and vice versa. So it's about taking athletes that have a surf background or involved in surf life saving and giving them the opportunity to open up their pathway and the opportunity in the Olympic sport of kayak. It's a win-win situation for both. Um, for Australia canoeing, it's important to increase the talent pool um, coming across into our organisation and then participating in international competitions. And hopefully it will increase you know, medal prospects at international competition. From surf lifesaving, it's giving that organisation a pathway on the international arena um, through competition. I think um, success for me in this program, um, sure, it, it may translate to uh, Australia being more competitive internationally, certainly in the sport of uh, canoe sprint. Um, but they're always hard to get those medals, and uh, you know the the process itself in raising the technical abilities of the community of paddlers, uh, uh, the growth and uh, development of our canoe coaches in both surf and flat water. Um, the uptake by the, the paddlers with this kind of information, um, that would be sort of measures of success for me, that uh, what we're trying to provide here is uh, more opportunities, more skills, more professional development, uh, more development of a, a community of, of paddlers, coaches and athletes that, that interact, and I think that that would be a, a huge measure of success. Uh, so in the last few years we've seen that we've developed quite good depth in, in the kayak team with the men but we don't yet have sufficient depth really to confidently move forward for the next few Olympic cycles with the women and, and therefore we'll be targeting uh, the younger women in surf life saving and teaching them the kayaking skills, having them develop their skis uh, as well as racing in the kayaks and, and I think that over time that will give us a much stronger, much greater depth and, and ultimately a stronger world championship and Olympic team as a result. I think it's, ex it's extremely exciting for the program. I think obviously um, sprint, sprint kayak is, is very, canoe kayak is very, very exciting. 200 metres, um, the 200 metre discipline is all about power and grunt, I suppose, from a layman looking at it. So obviously our athletes have to start off the beach and have to have that power and explosive power, the, the likes of Tate Smith that really have that explosive power off the beach. And we hope there is many more, and we're sure there's many more of those athletes that have that power to participate over the 200 metres out there in surf life saving. So it can only aid the program from where we sit. Absolutely. I think it's critical. We look at a pool of talent at the moment we've got a small pool of talent, but we've got this huge resource out there which is untapped through surf life saving. How many people are actually involved in surf life saving day to day nationwide? It's huge. And there's always been a, a slight, a, a small transfer across, but I think this way we're putting a structure in place, a larger pool we can you know, tap into, and we must get better results by doing that. So we are really excited about this. I'm sure surf life saving are also. Bigger pool, bigger fish.